Hi everybody, this is B3Net Games, and this is my updated tutorial on how to make projectiles destroy destructible meshes in Unreal Engine 4.10.1. Okay, so after we have the first person template open, we're going to want to go to content, click on content, and go to geometry, then meshes. Now, the 1M cube, we're going to want to right click that and create a destructible mesh. We'll get a destructible mesh customization window. Um, I'm going to input values that I just for this example. Okay, so 1200 for damage threshold, to zero for damage spread. Activate, enable impact damage. Um, so I'm going to get point four zero seven zero eight. I have another tutorial that goes over how to customize um, destructible meshes better. Okay, one for impact damage, depth, and fracture, and save. Minimize that. Now, we're going to want to drag this into the scene. Okay, now put it on the floor. So when we act it, or when we play the game, it doesn't, gravity doesn't automatically destroy, destroy it. Now there's some stuff we gotta uh, click on. Under physics, click on simulate physics. Um, click on simulation generates hit events. And make it a physics actor. And that should be it. Okay. Now we're going to want to go back to content, the content directory, then double click on first person BP, we'll click on blueprints, and first person projectile. Okay, so what we're going to want to do here, up at the top left, click on collision component, then um, click on Simulate Physics under Physics, and we're going to want to make this a physics actor inside the collision component. Now we're going to now we're going to want to go to Spear, and um, let's see, we're going to want to click. Here, I think, yeah, we just need to change it to uh, overlap all dynamic and generally overlap events. Okay. Now I'll compile and save. Minimize this window. And if all goes well when we play. Okay, so that's how you get projectiles to destroy destructible meshes in Unreal Engine 4.10.1. There's just a few modifications that need to be done. Um, thank you for watching, and stay tuned. Like and subscribe if you like my videos, please.